Hello, welcome to my channel. If you love biographies or history, leave a like. Now let's get back to the video. John Wesley Hyatt, born on November 28, 1837, in Starkey, New York, emerged as a pioneering inventor and entrepreneur who played a pivotal role in the development of plastics. His innovative contributions, particularly the invention of celluloid, revolutionized industries and paved the way for the modern era of synthetic materials. Growing up in a family of inventors, Hyatt inherited a curiosity for discovery. His early experiences with machinery and mechanics fueled his interest in invention. Hyatt's inventive spirit led him to experiment with various materials, eventually leading to his groundbreaking work in the field of plastics. In 1869, Hyatt achieved a significant breakthrough by inventing celluloid, the first commercially successful synthetic plastic. This revolutionary material was initially developed as a substitute for ivory and billiard balls, but quickly found applications across diverse industries. Celluloid became a versatile substance used in the production of photographic film, combs, buttons, and a myriad of consumer goods. Hyatt's invention of celluloid marked a turning point in the manufacturing landscape. It not only provided a practical solution to the depletion of natural resources, but also introduced a new era of materials that could be molded into various shapes and sizes. Celluloid's success laid the foundation for the subsequent development of other synthetic polymers. Hyatt's entrepreneurial spirit was evident in his establishment of the Albany Dental Plate Company, later known as the Celluloid Corporation. This venture focused on the production of dental plates and other goods made from celluloid, contributing to the widespread adoption of synthetic materials in various industries. Beyond celluloid, Hyatt continued his work in plastics, exploring new formulations and applications. His commitment to innovation earned him numerous patents and solidified his reputation as a leading figure in the plastics industry during the late 19th century. In addition to his contributions to plastics, Hyatt had a keen interest in other fields. He was involved in the development of a practical typewriter and founded the Hyatt Roller Bearing Company. His multifaceted career showcased an unwavering commitment to exploring new frontiers in technology and industry. John Wesley Hyatt passed away on May 10, 1920, but his impact on the world of plastics endured. His pioneering work laid the groundwork for the extensive use of synthetic materials in countless applications shaping the landscape of manufacturing and consumer goods. Hyatt's legacy remains intertwined with the evolution of plastics, a testament to the transformative power of innovation and the enduring influence of his contributions to the world of material science. Thank you for watching. Please leave a like and a sub.